O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. Firmly I believe, and truly, God is three, and God is one. And I next acknowledge duly manhood taken by the Son. And I trust and hope most fully in that manhood crucified. And each thought and deed unruly do to death as he has died. Simply to his grace and holy light and life and strength belong. And I love supremely solely him the holy, him the strong. Adoration I be given with and through the angelic host. To the God of earth and heaven, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. From the rising of the sun to its setting, great is the name of the Lord. Praise, O servants of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. May the name of the Lord be blessed, both now and forevermore. From the rising of the sun to its setting, praise be the name of the Lord. High above all nations is the Lord, above the heavens is glory. Who is like the Lord our God, who has risen on high to his throne, yet stoops on the heights to look down, to look down upon heaven and earth. From the dust he lifts up the lowly, from his misery raises the poor, to set him in the company of princes, yes, with the princes of his people. To the childless wife he gives a home, and glads her heart with children. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord. To the Spirit who dwells in our heart, both now and forever. Amen. From the rising of the sun to its setting, great is the name of the Lord. I will take the chalice of salvation, and I will call on the name of the Lord. I trusted even when I said, I am sorely afflicted. And when I said in my alarm, no man can be trusted. How can I repay the Lord for his goodness to me? The cup of salvation I will raise. I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill before all his people. O precious in the eyes of the Lord is the death of his faithful. Your servant, Lord, your servant am I. You have loosened my bonds. 
a thanksgiving sacrifice I make. I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill before all his people in the courts of the house of the Lord. In your midst, O Jerusalem, praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come at the end of the ages. I will take the chalice of salvation, and I will call on the name of the Lord. The Lord Jesus humbled himself, therefore God has highly exalted him forever. Though he was in the form of God, Jesus did not count equality with God a thing to be grasped. He emptied himself, taking the form of a servant, being born in the likeness of men, and being found in human form, he humbled himself and became obedient unto death, even death on a cross. Therefore God has highly exalted him, and bestowed on him the name which is above every name, that at the name of Jesus every knee should bow, in heaven and on earth and under the earth, and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord, to the glory of God the Father. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Lord Jesus humbled himself, Therefore God has highly exalted him forever. I pray that the God of peace, who brought our Lord Jesus back from the dead, to become the great shepherd of the sheep, by the blood that sealed an eternal covenant, may make you ready to do his will in any kind of good action, and turn us all into whatever is acceptable to himself through Jesus Christ, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. How great are your works, O Lord! How great are your works, O Lord! In wisdom you created them all. How great are your works, O Lord! Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. How great are your works, O Lord! You will bring those wretched men to a wretched end, and lease the vineyard to other tenants, who will deliver the fruits to him at the proper season. My soul glorifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God, my Saviour. He looks on his servant in her lowliness. Henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy is name. His mercy is from age to age. On those who fear him, he puts for his arm in strength and scatters the proud hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones and raises the lowly. He fills the starving with good things, sends the rich away empty. He protects Israeli servant, remembering his mercy, the mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. You will bring those wretched men to a wretched end and lease the vineyard to other tenants who will deliver the fruits to him at the proper season. 
Christ our Lord is mindful of all who need him and does great things for love of them. Let us not be afraid to ask, to ask him for all our needs. Show us your loving kindness. Lord, we know that the good things we have received today have come as a gift from you. May we receive them with thankfulness and learn how to give. Show us your loving kindness. Saviour and light of all people, keep missionaries in your special care. May the light of your spirit burn strongly in them. Show us your loving kindness. Grant that the world may be filled with the knowledge of your truth. Help us to carry out all you have called us to do. Show us your loving kindness. You healed the sickness and pain of your brothers. Bring healing and comfort to the spirit of man. Show us your loving kindness. Give rest to the faithful departed and bring them to praise you in eternity. Show us your loving kindness at the Saviour's command and for my divine teaching we dare to say Our Father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Almighty ever-living God whose love surpasses all that we ask or deserve open up for us the treasures of your mercy Forgive us all that weighs on our conscience and grant us more even than we dare to ask. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.